You know what true Adam and Akhlaq is? That's the Adam and Akhlaq of Sahaba Ikram. <laughs> they used to walk the world and people would be mesmerized by them. People would melt. They would be able to melt the hearts of people with their Adam and Akhlaq. What does it mean? They melted the hearts of people so much that when people met them, they would say to them that I want to be just like you. That's how they would accept Islam. There was no theological discussion that would take place. There was no teaching of entire Quran or comparative religion that took place. No. It was the adab and akhlaq of Sa'am Ikram. Just like those only Allah I told you that all of us are descended from, right? When they came to India, there was not some huge theological scholastic discussion of Hinduism, right? There was not some huge intellectual presentation of Islam. They had real adab and akhlaq. So people looked at them and said, I want to be just like you. How many of the quote-unquote secular Muslims can tell me today that people tell them that? How many of your colleagues have ever told you, I want to be just like you? How many of your sons have ever told you that I want to be just like you? Hmm? For Sahaba Ikram, absolute strangers would tell them that. Absolute strangers would tell them that. That's real Adam and Akhlaq. That's deep Adam and Akhlaq. Awliya Allah, but they came from abroad. They're also strangers, non-Indian. Awliya came into India. And all of our forefathers, at some level, said to them, I want to be just like you. 